good morning guys my name is uh, dr abasi i'm one of the co trainees uh, based in east midland i'm very pleased to share with you guys that uh, i managed to pass my cask exam um, in, in my very first attempt um, in september 2021 i died um, looking back at my journey um, uh, i can see that it was a hard work um, uh, you need a lot of uh, work to be done uh, in terms of your knowledge, in terms of applying that knowledge into um, practice. Uh, it needs dedication, commitment. Um, as far as my journey is concerned, uh, it took me about six to eight weeks to uh, start reading and uh, practicing that with colleagues, but most importantly, applying that knowledge, uh, especially with the patient, Assuming that uh, you are uh, under exam condition, just consider that seven minute consultation. So I think that is easy to do in terms of practice bit. But as far as content of the exam, what is expected uh, in the Royal College exam, um, you need uh, to read around and you need to find the right resource. Um, um, uh, I was lucky enough uh, to be get referred uh, by my colleague to Dr. Sechni's uh, team. And um, I think uh, I, uh, she she has guided me um, uh, in most most effective way, and uh, I can see now that um, um, I that small uh, that uh, very limited time period within that limited time period I managed to utilize those resources effectively um, um, with with her guidance, and most importantly. Um, um, it is very important for you guys who, who is uh, thinking to appear in January to plan from now onward. And um, I found um, uh, Dr. Sechni's past the cast book very helpful. That helped me in organizing uh, my knowledge in a structurized um, um, uh, way um, to apply that uh, knowledge um, in a consultation, um, within seven minute consultation, I would say. So I would say find out the right um, um, uh, reading resource for yourself so you know that what is expected and how to be asked in a more concise way. Um, I would recommend that book and without any doubt. And secondly, I've been lucky enough again, I would say that I, um, um, that, uh, I got a mentor like Dr. Uh, Dr. Seshni, uh, uh, who is a very kind person, who has been very... Um, um, flexible, uh, dedicated, committed, and um, more importantly, she has been uh, easy to approach. Even on the day of exam, when there were some doubts, uh, I was feeling a bit anxious. I managed to talk to her, and she was always available uh, during that time period. So it is very important to have a mentor, uh, as we do have uh, in. We look at the sports. No doubt, and uh, no matter how good you are in terms of your skills, you always need uh, to polish your uh, those skills. And uh, so, mentor your tutor would be able to uh, have a helicopter view on your performance and uh, would be able to give you indi individualized feedback because everyone is different uh, and their needs uh, can be different. So, which need to be identified and rectified in a timely manner. So I definitely recommend Dr. Sechni's um, um, for your cask uh, preparation on this journey. And uh, I'm again thankful to Dr. Sechni and his team for their effort. Um, I make a real difference when I'm looking back to six to eight week uh, um, time. Um, um, now, luckily, uh, I managed to get a higher training uh, placement for February uh, 2022. Um, on and that was first choice. I mean, so it make a lot of difference if you use the uh, if you use the resources uh, um, effectively. So that make a big difference. So I wish you all guys um, good luck with your exam and uh, in career. So thank you very much for for your time. Thank you.